smoke them. Serious music all the cats enjoy. This is your host, Black Widow Medea. I just wanted to come out and actually make her kind of respond to what um, Floss Carter is talking about, right? Floss Carter is a hardcore tech reviewer. If you're into tech, technology like smartphones, headphones, um, anything to do with technology, power banks, anything like that, this man will review it. He's one of the best ones, one of the better ones that I like to watch. Very good, very informative. He's funny, you know, has his own style and his own way of doing things. Now, was, I think it was last week he actually re- reviewed this this um, phone, which is by a new company that's black owned, a new telephone company that's black owned, and what happened is basically this is Floss explaining what happened. Last week I watched him unbox this phone from this company which I'm not going to name and the presentation was on point it was nice it's a really 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 good presentation real nice box but watching the video you can tell that Floss wasn't 100% sure about some of the information about the phone everybody knows that Floss is very detailed he likes to know what the processor is and the, what the Bluetooth is, and, and you know, small minor details that for him, you know, is a good way of like letting people know about this particular phone. So I want you to go to his um, channel, Flossy Carter, and you'll see, you'll hear his explanation. Because what happened is, this he eventually ended up pulling down the video, and this is what he's really talking about here. He's actually on holiday at the moment. Now, shout out to Floss. We're right, happy of a good time. And um, he's explaining the controversy of what's been going on. Because he said, and I'm not going to say every single thing because I wanted to go and watch this video, right? And this is why I tell in my video the way it is. Because when you're doing business with black people, they can never be straight with you. They're always hustling, always, you know, slimy and grimy and not being honest with you. And one of the things with this particular company that no one's heard of, once he presented this phone, I never, he, he said he never heard of them. Once he said it, I never heard of them. So I went, I went and looked them up, looked at their website, website is really crappy it doesn't give you no information about nothing and this phone that flossy was actually reviewing was supposed to be their top high-end phone it comes to find out that when flossy like, like i said when you go to his channel floss he will tell you right what more information about the phone and they will be in a, being vague about it So they sent him the phone. He's not getting paid to do it. He's just done a review on it. And it turns out that the processor that they're using for the phone is three years old. Very, very old. You know, know, in in, in the tech world, using a processor that's three years old is very, very old. Right? And for someone like Floss, he's not going to really want to review a phone that's that's got a processor that's three years old and my thing is why wasn't the company open with him and honest with him you see with black people now they would what this what this company wanted was actually publicity and he gave it to them so instead of them being honest with him and saying look we're using the old processor in here you know do you have any suggestions of how we can make this phone better right they could have networked with this dude right here they could have networked with him maybe done a deal with him negotiated a deal with him and maybe have him design a phone for them network with him no instead of them kind of like being honest with him 
I just had to kind of flip it on him. Like he, you know, he's because t- he took the video, eventually took the video down. Like I said, I, want, I need people to go back, go over to his channel if you're into technology and listen to him, listen to this blog that he's put out here and the reasons why he pulled the video down. And one of the things that I noticed is that when he told them the reason why he pulled the video down, because I found out one of his tech boys told him, look, that phone there has got old technology in it. Right? <clears throat> he said in this video that instead of them saying, you know, come, come up with an explanation why they have an older processor in the phone, they just trying to flip it to make it sound like as if he took down the video because he's beefing with some other with some there's some other guys on Twitter, you know, who him and them are having beef with. You know what I mean? And he said he doesn't even know who these people are. So the point I'm trying to make is that he's telling them the reason why I pulled the video down, and they're trying to flip it. So they're not addressing the fact that he's telling them you have an old processor in it. And the phone is like a, 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 a pretty looking trap phone, basically. You know, he doesn't like the, doesn't like the phone. So, doing, people with, doing business with black people is so hard. I try my best to support black businesses, right? But when stuff like this comes out, because even I was trying to look at the company and say, hmm, how come I've never heard of them before? They need to market themselves better. I looked on their website, they got pictures of white people on there. You know, I'm saying, why you got white people on there? Why you got these white families on there? Why you don't have some black faces on your, on your, on your advertising? Right? You want Floss to kind of, you know, promote, not promote, but, but you know, talk about your product to get people to buy it. But yet you shitted on them at the same time. You shitted on this man. Right? Because once he spoke on it, right, spoke on your product, I went and looked you up. I said, this company needs to be marketed properly. And I had a plan put it together. But now that Floss come up with this video, I said, "Mm -mm, we can forget it. And you can see that this company don't have a clue what they're doing, a clue what they're talking about. And I don't like the fact they try to use people, right, to get um, some form of promotion. And I turn around, I want to blame him for the reason why he took the video down. You wasn't honest with him. These people don't know how to do business with people. And this is why I will never do business with black people, especially when it comes to stuff like that. Black people don't know nothing about no business. They have no business sense. This man could have helped you. This man was, you, you didn't, this guy, he wasn't paying this guy no money. Right, you, you want to pay me? He said no. I'll take a look at this phone. Right, I, you know he said yeah, I want to get. If you want me to to um, you want to pay me, I do an ad on it. I do a nice ad for you, and you pay me for that. But I'm going I'm to review this and give you my honest opinion. So this is why I will never ever do business with black people. Not like that. Not the way how I see they treat this guy here. And this is a cool guy. He's, you know, he's, he's not a nerd, he's not a geek, he's just an average black guy who seems to like a lot of gadgets and stuff, you know, and I, I like watching his channel because I learn things from him. I feel like I can go into Best Buy and see products there and I understand what that particular product does because of Floss doing the review on it. So this is why I don't do business with black people at all. They're always trying to rip you off. They're always trying to undermine you. They're always sneaky. And you can't, they're always, they're always, um, they're never honest with you. They're never, they're never really honest with you. I don't think this company's gonna go nowhere. You know, the name of the company is awful. You know, the, the, the guy who owns it named it after himself. And it's like, oh my God, come on, your name is not that, your name is not like a Trump sounding type name. It's, it's, it sounds really horrible to say. And for a phone, it doesn't seem right. Nah. Nah. You know, you, this company needs to rebrand itself and market itself way better than, than they have so far because no one's heard of it. So, shout out to Floss. Don't worry about anything, Floss. You did the right thing by pulling the video down because you don't want to be reviewing the phone and getting people to, you know, telling people, not telling people to go buy it, but you're kind of, you know, what's what you're basically doing, you're saying this is a good phone, and when people go buy it now, it's an old phone, it's an old processor, it's slow, 
you know, especially in the tech world, right? You know, Foss is basically saying this phone is basically, if you, if, if you present it to a kid, a little teenager or a young kid who doesn't care about about style, not style, but, you know, doesn't care about the processing part of it, and it's cool to give to a young kid. But for people who are older, who are understanding technology now, they want the, the thing to be fast. And if they're using old, old processes, and this is their one phone they have, their, their flagship phone, that's out of order. I mean, why, why is this company using old material and trying to sell it to black people? Because they couldn't, try to, they couldn't sell it to white people like that. Right, I would sell to white people like that. They're trying to hit, they're trying to sell it to the black people who don't know technology. So shout out to Floss for standing on his for standing on his two, right? And say, listen, I'm not putting I'm not putting no video up on my channel, right? Where I'm getting things wrong because I'm I'm, I'm you're telling me this and I'm checking it out. It's you know it's not what you say it is. So this is the reason why I do not do business with black people they always try to rip you off they're always scheming and always trying to hide things from you they can't be honest here is an opportunity for this particular company to get with someone like floss and work with each other but no they try to, they try to shit on him right and try to bring other people into the argument and make try to make him look silly but he, you know he caught on to it so um shout out to you floss I, I wanted to ask you about this when you was in your live the other day, but I um, I completely forgot that I'm using your footage. So please don't flag me, okay? So um, I look forward to another video from you. So this is the reason why I don't do business with black people. Go check out um, Flossy Carter, right? Check him out if you're into tech technology. <laughs> He's a hardcore tech freak, right? He reviews phones and all sorts of stuff. Do you check him out? Subscribe to him. He he one of them big YouTubers. He a big YouTuber, right? And subscribe to my channel too. Smoke him. Megan.